This is disgusting. disgusting. And my name is Ossi, also known as Zeroness. Erno has a lot of friends, making it impossible to cover all of them in one episode. Instead, we'll meet one particular friend who has even moved to Finland because of him. I saw Erno on the internet one time, and I thought that is such a magnificent specimen of a cockerel that I have to find him in real life. So. I gave up studying in England, in my home country, and I have to move to Finland to find Erna. So, a few years ago I moved to Finland and now I finally found him. He's a good listener, he's always pretty quiet, but I'm, I think he understands. And you can tell him about your problems, he just, he just doesn't answer very much. But I, I'm sure he like, empathises and sympathises in his own way. Well, sometimes he, he's unconscious for quite a long time and it can be worrying, but he always seems to wake up and start drinking again, so he, he must be okay. Well, when you see him at parties, he really gets into it. I think it's more to do with that he enjoys it rather than he does it to escape. No, I've been stalking him actually. Um, I've, I've followed most of the videos that he's been in and uh, I've, I've asked lots of questions about him on the internet and I've even made the Facebook group about him. I'm, I, I stalk him, it's, it's just that simple. It's called I, I Wish Erna Was Straight. And uh, I, I started it a while ago and it's got a few members now. So I, I think there are other people, other similar minded people to me on the internet who feel the same way. I really laughed. Yeah, we, we, we completely understand each other. I, I feel her pain. No, we, we totally accept Erna for what he is, and, and he is he is gay. And we're not hoping to convert him, but we, we just kind of wish that one day, you know, it, it might happen, it, a miracle might happen, that one day he's straight, and then, then we'll have a spark of hope. But, but for now, it's just, it's just a desperate wish. I don't think he takes it very seriously, and, and we take it only half seriously, so... He, he, doesn't, he doesn't seem offended by it anyways. I, I think he maybe likes just the attention. But he, he's, we think he's really more into it. I'm a bit disappointed because I think they encourage him, you know, but in saying that, I think it's not just girls who are welcome to the group on Facebook that I started, it's anyone who has perhaps been a bit too close to Erno while he's been at the party and really also wishes that he's straight. Yeah. But, ah, oh, I, it's a bit sad, I think that I wish Erno, uh, I'm glad Erno is gay, has more members than that I wish Erno is straight. That's why I don't think we're getting any change soon. Erno is Erno, in real life and online too. If moving to Finland isn't an option, then uh, I would advise you to watch all the videos that are on the internet about him, because you can learn a lot from him about the videos that are made about him. So, mm -hmm. And you can also see where he's been. And you can kind of glean a lot of information about his likes and dislikes and beer. And, and alcohol from, from the internet. He's quite active online. And of course, join this group. Yes, please join my group because the more members it has, then uh, maybe he'll consider. Oh, okay. Thank you. <laughs> In my opinion, it's really important that uh, you can argue with your friends. I don't think you're right. I think what you're talking right now, it's just bullshit. You don't like me anymore. You're not my friend anymore. Fuck you. Friendship is something that you can say things that you don't want to hear, but you need to hear. And because of that, you might have some kind of an argument, fights and so. Just like I do. Sometimes with Erno and sometimes with some other friends. That's friendship. Isn't it?
Thank <laughs> you.